Hi, I'm AJ Wilcox, the chief LinkedIn ads fanatic here at b2linked.com, the LinkedIn ads agency. What sort of access to LinkedIn ads do you need to do your job? There are two kinds of access that you're going to need. The first is you need access to an ads account. And then the second is if you actually want to publish any ads, you need to have access to the company page as well. I'm going to walk you through both. So first off in your ads account, if you go down to account settings and then manage access, so whoever has admin access and is going to be adding you, this is what they're going to do. I'm going to go in and add someone and just for fun, I'm going to add Mark Cuban. I can see the different options that LinkedIn gives me. Viewer is viewer only. They can see everything in the account, but they can't make any sort of changes. Creative manager is someone who can create ads and they can see everything, but they can't make any sort of changes to campaigns. Campaign manager is someone who can create and edit any of the campaigns in the account. Account manager is the admin. They can do anything they want to in the account and they can add and remove users. So I'm going to add Mark Cuban as a viewer here and add. Each account has one billing admin. This is the person who's responsible for having the credit card entered in and they're the only ones who can make payment decisions. They have to be an account manager to do this. And you can see if I click make billing admin here on myself, that makes me the billing admin. But be aware when you do this, it shuts off the credit card from whoever it was before. And then you have to immediately enter the credit card again. Now you might notice when you go to do this, you might have a message saying that your account access is given through another product called business manager. It's a little bit different of a process, but the roles are exactly the same thing. We'll come back to that. The second kind of access you'll need is access to your company page. I have my company page up here to show you. If I'm an admin right here in the bottom left, I'll see the settings. And then I can click manage admins. And again, for fun, I'll add Mark Cuban. When I click add admin, you can see I have several different options. Super admin is someone who has access to change anything on the page. They can add or remove people like I'm doing now. They can post content. Uh, they can delete comments, any of that kind of stuff. Content admin can just manage the content, posts and comments, that kind of thing, but they can't add or remove people. And curator and analyst, I don't really care about because they're probably not going to help me do anything with advertising. You'll also see this tab here called paid media admins. And if I click add paid media admin, it gives me three different options of what I can add. If you are creating ads inside of campaign manager, you need at least sponsored content poster. This lets you create ads. And if you're going to be using LinkedIn's native lead gen forms, you're going to need lead gen forms manager. These are the most basic permissions you're going to need. You can ignore landing page admin unless you use the LinkedIn recruiter product. For more awesome LinkedIn ads, tips, tricks, and how to's, make sure to subscribe to the LinkedIn ad show podcast. Also consider joining our private community, the LinkedIn ads fanatics. That's at fanatics.b2linked.com. And we'll see you there.